I spent the night in the Country Music Hall of Fame. I saw the stars and called them all by name. They seemed so happy singing for God above. I told them how we missed them. Everybody sends their love. I was on a tour bus in Nashville that went to the Hall of Fame. It was late in the day, and I was so engrossed by the wonder of it all, the time just seemed to slip away. I noticed all at once it was quiet, and I looked around and I was alone. Then suddenly I saw Hank Williams playing his guitar and writing a brand new song. As he spoke, Hank put his guitar aside and he looked up and grinned. It's sure good to see you. Come with me and I'll show you around, my friend. Over here is the Jim Reeves Corner, where he conducts the choir every day. And that's pretty Patsy Cline. She's smiling because she and Marty Robbins are singing a duet today. Bob Wills, Tex Ritter, Lefty Frizzell, Cowboy Copas, Hawkshaw Hawkins, Jack Anglin, and Ernest Tubb. All the greats are gathered around. And I'll tell you, when they lift their voices together, it's really a heavenly kind of sound. Johnny Horton and Jimmy Rogers, the old blues yodeler, play guitar. Uncle Dave, the poor string. And the poor string bean and red sabine keep us all laughing when we try to sing. And you know, we're all so proud of the young man you see standing there. We needed his voice to get the perfect sound in our choir. Recognize his face? Sure you do. Everybody called him King. But we just call him Elvis. Let me tell you, friend, that boy can really sing. Well, suddenly the lights came on and I heard someone say, Who's there? Don't you know we're closed for the day? Well, I opened my eyes and asked myself, was it real? Or had it all been a dream? Did I really talk to the stars in the country music hall of fame?